Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Superhero Game Squad. Today in gaming, we have some shattering records and we also have some extremely sad news to report to you guys. So let's get started with this episode of Squad News. Hey guys, I'm Riff. Could you help this video get past 200 likes? I would really appreciate it. Okay, last night on Twitch, there was some groundbreaking records set by your favorite gamer of all time, Drake. Apparently. You heard me last night, Drake joined up with the newly popular Ninja for a Fortnite stream, which reached over 600,000 concurrent views. And as well, Travis Scott and Juju Smith Schuster also joined in the party for a little while. I find this really interesting because Dr. Disrespect broke some records just a few weeks ago on Twitch, and now we are having new records being broken, so Twitch is kind of on a viral trend right now of people coming from all over to check out video games. Getting this many people over to Twitch to watch this stream might not have been as hard as we think because you have a big celebrity tweeting out that he is playing Fortnite with over millions and millions and millions of followers. There's a lot of people bound to hop over in the stream. Whether you listen to Drake or you play Fortnite or not, this is a big achievement for Twitch. So I want to say congratulations to Twitch and also congratulations to gaming as a whole because this is a lot of people watching video games at one time. If you play the Nintendo Switch and you lose things easily, you might want to steer away from this next thing I'm talking about. Last year, a man named Mahira Summer made a bunch of full-size Switch cases for downloadable titles. And he is back in 2018 with something much different and much, much, much smaller. He has created a range of different cases for your Nintendo Switch games, but are exactly the size of Nintendo Switch games. This could work for someone like me who is extremely extremely organized and extremely particular about where I put my video games and all my different products and things I have in life. But if you're messy or you're someone who loses things easily, I don't recommend getting these or trying to get your hands on them because you're going to lose them right away. Regardless of how adorable and cute these things are, do you trust yourself enough to purchase or get your hands on these little cases? I myself, I think I could do it. I think I can handle it. But let me know about you guys down in the comments below. Do you like the Soul Calibur games? Do you like the Witcher series? If you said yes to both of those, or maybe even just one, you're in for a treat. That is because it has been confirmed that Geralt of Rivia from the Witcher series will be in Fighter Soul Calibur 6. We just got this news and we got it directly on Twitter from the Witcher themselves. They said we are excited to announce that Geralt of Rivia will be joining the playable characters roster of Bandai Namco's Soul Calibur. With this news, who would you guys like to see in a Soul Calibur game? I know we've had characters from Assassin's Creed, we've had Darth Vader, we've had Yoda, now we're getting Geralt. Who do you want to see? Let me know down in the comments below. This is like the Smash Brothers talk, but Soul Calibur. And not to be a downer and ending on bad news, but we've been talking about Toys R Us all the time here on this channel and how they went through bankruptcy and they're trying to hold on with all they can, but no, today, we just found out that the CEO told us that yes, in fact, Toys R Us is shutting down every single one of their stores in the United States. The Wall Street Journal reported to us that CEO David Brandon made this news official with the filing of liquidation papers. Toys R Us also has other separate businesses in Canada and Asia, and the company's Asian business is reportedly the most profitable and will continue to operate. I did a full video on Toys R Us just the other day. Feel free to check out that video if you want, but let me know what you guys are feeling with Toys R Us going away in the United States. I know there is also Toys R Us in Australia, but over there they're saying the stores are possibly in jeopardy as well. So so Toys R Us, regardless of anything that happens to you, will always remember you as a loving place in our hearts. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching today. We really appreciate it. Again, help me get this video past 200 likes. It would mean the world to me. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure and tune in today around two o'clock. I'm gonna be playing some Nintendo Switch Hidden Gems on YouTube live stream. So I'll see you guys then. Have a good day and I'll talk to you very soon. Have a beautiful day, you beautiful people.